guys, I'm pretty sure the horde is underway. I was doing a little bit of offline work, and um, we got to the horde day is happening, and um, unless... Yeah, there it is. I was like, unless it stopped... Wait, how are they... Hold on. How are they getting across? Excuse me? How have some of them gotten across the... the the moat. I built a moat. How did some of them get across it? I'm so confused. Anyway, I was doing some uh, off-stream work, right? I just wanted to beautify the base a bit. I got some stone bricks down and stuff like that. I decided to build a coke oven. All that I needed to do in order to get the coke oven is I just needed to get some clay because it's like a really easy thing to make, right? It's just clay. You make bricks and then I dug up some sand, got some sandstone, and um, it's just 27 of those blocks. And um, I was like in the process of continuing the beautification and then it said, oh, the horde has arrived. So we're in process here. And I'm I'm really hoping that our, our moat is going to hold us over. Although for whatever reason, a couple of those dude bros just like got their way across. But otherwise it seems to be working out fairly well. I'm just... A little worried about the the pregante. Oh, some of them can jump. Okay, that guy just jumped. That guy just jumped. I wasn't ready for the guy to be jumping. I didn't know that they could jump. That's a little concerning. Ah, uh, they can also push each other. Huh. Noted. Okay. Well, in that case, let's just. You know, break this out here, and we'll deal with the uh, the guys who seem to be able to get over with a little bit of old-fashioned elbow grease. Anyway, so I was doing all this off-camera work, and uh, then I was like, oh, we're probably going to have to stop because the horde has arrived, and I'm going to have to do that on camera in order to, you know, be able to see how things, uh, how things go with our setup here. You know what I think is the issue, though? It seems like they're pushing each other over the corner where the fence is, so I wonder if I kind of block that side off, if it'll do anything. Like, it seems... Like, what if I do that? What if I kind of block this off here? I wonder if that'll help. And then that way they won't be able to... Well, then they might stand on that. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do that, and I'm gonna see if it makes a difference in anything, um, but what I can also do is I can go up on the roof, right, and I can get a get a better vantage point over here. Um, that said, okay, so in between this episode and the last one, um, in the th holy frick, in the thumbnail world, I flew around for ages trying to see if I could find a building that kind of specializes in immersive engineer. Bro, what? That's actually insane. They can straight up vault and boost each other. Holy frick. What are we... What is that? What in the world? Okay, okay. Whoa! Okay, at least the Pregante are getting wrecked. Makes it better when that happens. Holy frick. Yeah, dude, it's World War Z. Oh my god. So anyway, I flew around for ages, spectator mode, going inside of buildings, looking at stuff. Couldn't find a building that's dedicated to immersive engineering, so that's why I decided at that point, like, let me just make the coke oven. And that's why I was like, okay, I'll just be able to sit here kind of AFK for a little bit, because all this thing does, you throw coal in, if you've not seen this before. It processes it into coal coke, and you get the creosote as a byproduct, which is what we need to make the treated wood that goes into the gunsmith table, well, the engineering workbench. So... That's what I was going to do, is just kind of sit and wait for that to process, do some beautification in the basement, that whole thing. Um, and that was the plan prior to the horde. Uh-oh. 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 I hear the sounds of a large man. And I don't like that. Oh... Oh, that's not a good thing. I'm gonna need to go get some more bullets here. We haven't taken one of those guys down, but I'm gonna need to give that my focus. So what do we... The problem that we have right now 
is I am in a bad spot when it comes to ammunition for guns that I possess. And I don't like that. Oh, God. Hey, buddy, tell me you can't walk over the fences and stuff. Okay, this might not be good. He can walk on top. He can walk on top. Mm. He can walk on top. Okay, so that's not good. That's not good at all. Um, well then. Okay. Oh, dear. What are we gonna do about this? What are we gonna do about this situation? Hey. Okay, um... This is an issue. This is an issue. Why do I have to have all these M4s with zero ammo, and I've never found... I have never found M4 ammo other than, like, I found five once. Um... Here comes another wave. Okay. I'm I'm concerned right now. I can cheese him. He has so much health, dude. Six hundred twenty health. Oh, he's taking. Why is he taking? A oh, he's taking a residual electrical damage from my cattle prod. Oh my god! I mean, this is working. I'm gonna just demolish my cattle prod, trying to fight the demolisher. But I mean, honestly, I feel like I've lucked out here. Also, I'm I'm here with minimal health because obviously when you load the world again. It just resets you to baseline. Doesn't consider your bonus. That's just kind of a Minecraft limitation, you know? Anytime you load up a mod pack where you get extra hearts, it always kind of doesn't like it whenever you load the world. This is, um... <laughs> his poor feetsies, you say. I feel no remorse. I got no more bullets. Frick. Slowly but surely, we're working him down. Fortunately, we haven't had to worry about other... Zombies getting on the roof for the time being. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to Captain Sparkles 2 to stay tuned for more of one of my favorite mod pack series that we have done in many years. Oh, the horde has stopped. Bro, no kidding. My, so my, my trap, my moat must have worked fairly well if the horde was able to subside. Well, I'm just focused on this guy, so honestly, not bad. The issue <laughs> is that if at day 75 they can break blocks, we're going to be dealing with a different story. Which is why I got... Oh, I thought it was M4 ammo, which would have been cool. Okay, well, there's definitely more guys here who are wanting to get in, but let's let's lure him into the pit, dude. Let's lure him into the pit. There we go. That's better. That's more like it. Let's go. Come on. We love the mode around here, dude. I've been kind of like brainstorming though. What is that guy called, by the way? A bomber. Yeah, no, no, you're not gonna poison me. I was just thinking for thumbnail purposes, because the hardest thing about thumbnails sometimes is knowing what zombie to summon in the thumbnail world. <laughs> that said, I was trying to think about what another uh, step up in, in a base could be, which could potentially mean that all of my aesthetic upgrades here that I'm trying to do are going to be a waste. Um, but I was almost thinking maybe rather than going super remote on an island in the ocean or something like that, instead, what I could do is build up basically like a, like the Space Needle. Think of, think of it like the Space Needle in Seattle, right? Kind of a skinny like access point up the center. And then it's like a, a large kind of, I don't know, circular rectangular area at the top. And I have vantage points so I can shoot down big moat around the whole thing with barbed wire, that whole whole deal. And that seems like even if they can break blocks, they'd have to get up in order to be able to break blocks that would be um, high resistance fabric. I think this is actually good because I was looking into some recipes for things. Um, in between the episodes. But that said, all right, that was like, that was significant. I think high resistance fabric probably goes in the armor. Um, That was a significantly smoother experience than Horde Night number one Um, after we got over our initial holy frick, the zombies can World War Z themselves. So 
That's pretty slick. Um, anyway, in the meantime, though, I think uh, we should be able to make some treated wood. And then we can use that in order to make the engineer's workbench and actually start being able to purchase ammo. There we go. Bucket of creosote. Don't drink this. Mmm. Yummy byproduct of coal being melted and burned a second time. Sounds delicious. Uh, okay, so I'm pretty sure we just surround that with wood, and it turns into treated wood planks. Yup. And then, oiled up and ready to go. Yeah. Brother. Oh, moat drops? That's a good point. Let's see if there's anything in there. I wouldn't be surprised if barbed wire uh, breaks drops, so it might, yeah. Oh, actually, wait, there is some stuff in there. I mean, okay. Just gotta be careful. It doesn't actually... Might have had a few despawns in there, but... No, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't you Don't you be doing that. I could actually... It's not a bad idea. Like, put some hoppers down. Any zombies? I heard someone. Get some hoppers down in there. Yeah, so that they... Uh, and collect some of the, uh, some of it's still gonna fall. I guess it could be under the barbed wire too. Have to be a lot of hoppers to be fair. Uh, I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Okay, so what else was it? In order to make the engineer's workbench, um, which I'm pretty sure was, yeah, it was this one. Okay, so it's just traded wood slab. Easy, dude. Freaking easy. There. And then we just get, in order to make the fence, is it, um, in order to make the fences have to be treated, everything has to be treated. Oh, you're telling me I'm one short. Story of my life being short. Okay, there we go. At least we have more. And there we go. Big plays. Huge stuff. And now we should be able to make the gunsmith table. A.K.A. the engineer's workbench. It's interesting that this is what is tied to the gunsmith, but we take these. You're right, a hopper minecart on rails could be a good system. I don't want to go like that in depth, though, probably until base 2.0, because otherwise it's like, oh, we'd have this whole system and then I'd have to relocate the whole thing, potentially. Um, all right, mate. Come on. Gunsmith. Holy frick, he takes a lot of money to buy this. But, man... I need ammo, okay? Tell me that you sometimes trade ammo out the gate instead of just... Frick. God dang it. Man. Come on. Ammo. Don't tell me I'm gonna have to rank the frick up out of you in order to get ammo. Oh, I can cycle trades. I forgot. Well... Alrighty. Um... Yeah, I forgot about cycling trades, but we good. Hmm... <laughs> God, listen to him, dude. It's crazy noises. So, what Parabellum seems to be the uh, most regular thing for us to get. So I feel like a gun that takes Parabellum bullets could be a good secondary pistol. And then you know what I could do? I could probably take the silencer off here, put it in that. Um, that's not a bad idea. Let's buy this. Although, holy sweet mother of God, is it expensive, bro. I have to st I have to trade him stacks of blocks. I honestly may need to go back to the high rise and start yoinking more money. Okay, sick. Okay, it almost does fully level him up though, which is good. <laughs> listen to the listen to the shell casing sounds. Um, yeah. Oh, there's another building that has money blocks other than the apartment. There, I'm surprised there's not like a bank building. You know, you would think that a bank building would probably exist here. You know, Yuri Kiriyama, thank you for the 31 months. Much appreciated. Okay, guess we'll buy one of these bad boys. Okay, what's our next level up, man? Tell me it's some bullets. There are banks. How have I not seen a bank yet? <gasps> yes. Yes. It's so expensive, though. It's so expensive. Um, okay, honestly... I'm thinking we go Glock. I'm thinking we go Glock, because we got... We always have Parabellum bullets. 
we always have parabellum bullets, it feels like. And then um, we'll be able to, you know, keep buying them and stuff like that. So let's see, parabellum's there. I'm trying to remember, how did I... Wait, where's my... Is this one, right? What? What's the key? What's the key again? Uh, in order to access the gun freaking stuff? Okay, it was Z. We got it. Okay, so pistol suppressor. Let's put that onto this here. And then... Wait. Oh, there we go. Wait. Perfect. Wait. Is the Glock not compatible with the pistol suppressor? Oh, it is. Okay, cool. Hey, man. All right, I shouldn't. Sorry, I'm not. I don't mean to point that at you. Put it back on the same gun. Good stuff. Dang, bro. Let's go. This is sick. All right. And then we can buy more. I mean, I suppose I can buy really. Yeah, I could buy either ammo, but let's just do this one. Yeah. It's pretty common. Okay, God, I want to be able to get these at some point, but it's so expensive, and I don't have any of these resources at all whatsoever. So I guess I might as well keep my money in full-on uh, money stacks, because uh, I guess they don't do anything for individual bills out here, which is kind of fricked, man, but whatever. All right, let's do a few more of these. A few more of these. I'm going to need to re-up on my moolah, dude. Oh, man. Oh, man. Our stonks are way down. I need more monies. I need more monies. Uh, does Fletcher give you money for trading sticks? That's a good question. I could check. Why do I have a feeling that it's going to be different, but watch it be that you get $1 for, like, every 32 or something. At least I can check before I, you know, commit to it. I never mind any gravel, by the way. Apparently, I've never mined any gravel. I should go and do that. All right. Uh, Cerberus with 200 bits. How did you fix the exit code one error to play this pack? Uh, I don't know what that is. I have never had exit code one error. I was getting this so I could make stone bricks. I am unfortunately ill-equipped to tech support you. I apologize. Everything has worked well for me on uh, on this whole thing. So, yeah. Hex to the ghost. Thank you for the 10 months. All right. Oh, you know another thing, though, that I made? I made these white lamps. They're very cool. You just take a torch, and then you have a little bit of wool with them and sticks and stuff like that, and it makes a very cool little lamp that's very swick. And, um, anyway. I don't want to go too all out here, obviously, because if we, if we do plan to make kind of a more secure base later. We wouldn't want to put all of the effort here to waste. Um, but anyway, that said, I'm going to go buy some... Okay, it's about nighttime. But when I say buy, I mean I'm going to find some gravel, which should be right over yonder. Much easier to find than the, uh, well, a little closer by than the sand and the clay, which is just over there. So we should be all good to go. Everyone, what you then? I think there's... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Plenty of gravel. Quest completed. Gravel. <laughs> Waited a long time to get this, apparently. Oh, yeah. Bison's still around. He's over in the ocean. He's hanging out. Just having a good good time. Maxing, relaxing, all cool. You know what I also need to get? Is I need to go get lapis. I had to repair my pickaxe with a couple of diamonds while I was just doing the, you know, stone brick work. Um... I also, you know, there was a little bit of just this thing floating above the ground, and as the HOA, I felt compelled to make it HOA compliant, so I uh, put some dirt down there so that it would... Oh, yeah, we won hit. Let's go, boys. I put some dirt down so it was less floaty, you know? It's on brand. Gotta be on brand. The last thing that would be nice, though, is just some stairs. Like, lead some stairs up from there to there. Maybe we'll, we'll do that. We'll see. Um, but that said, today would also be a good day to get some water wheels going, I think. I think it wouldn't be the worst idea in the world. Um, hey, Roy. How about we get another... Another flint? Another flint? Another flint would be great. 
By the way, if you're interested in checking out a, um, you know, this mod pack and playing with your friends, you could go and hit up our sponsor, Apex Hosting. Link in the description, or use code Captain Sparkles to grab yourself 25% off your first month of server hosting. And then you can survive some zombies with your friendos. I have a feeling this is going to be a uh, disappointing outcome, but here we go. How are we looking here? <laughs> yeah. So, it's not the most efficient way to do things. I was thinking, you know, if you get a stack of bucks for 32, that's cool, but that's... That's a lot of sticks to get a single thing of bullets. Bank? How have I not... I don't understand. I mean, granted, I was looking for immersive engineering stuff, so my focus was not on a, a bank. But I just didn't see anything that looked to me like a, a bank. You know? I guess to be fair, actually, if we had a create tree farm, that would be a way to do it. That would be a way to do it, you know? Spiral, oh, the spiral glass towers. Guys, it may be time to rob a bank. Just throwing it out there, dude. Just throwing it out there. Um, but like, I thought we were in one of the spiral glass buildings. I thought we did that. Yeah, okay, we're getting more creosote. Let me do, let me do a little quick, um, I I'm also, I feel like I need to get mechanical crafters, and those I know you can find in the, this, this shaped residential houses. Uh, you can find a couple of them in each one, so that might be a good thing to do. But anyway, let me, I want to do some water wheels. Where are the water wheels? How do I do that? All right, shaft surrounded by some wood skis there. Easy peasy. I'll just make some shafts here as well. Cool. And, um, yeah, that'll be good stuff. I might need to go out and mine and break a bit more trees, you know? Well, eight water wheels is also not bad, but it depends if we're going to go for a, uh, I don't know if we're going to go for any windmills at any point. Eh, I'll just do ten of them. You know what I could do? Might be an interesting way to go about it, is just, like, I could just have them at the base of, of this area here, and I could have like a little waterfall coming off the edge, and then these things will be, uh, you know, underneath or something like that. Possibly. Um, make the uh, big water wheels? Oh, large water wheel. Oh, you just surrounded another thing of wood. Sure. Do those generate a lot more stress? I haven't actually uh, used them. So don't, I don't know how they'd be looking. Oh, this guy. Hey, I'm ready for him this time, man. Oh, I got ammo for days. I got ammo for days, buckaroo. Oh, we have two of them? Oh, we got two of them. Wait. Why does this thing do way less... Okay, frick. Guys? I'm sad to report... This seemed to do way less damage. I may need to switch back to my... Oh, a 9x19 is smaller than a 45 ACP, but they're the same cost for the same amount of bullets. Guys! This might not be ideal. Oh, it's because you can make it go auto? Ah. Well, I'm not planning on doing that. Guys, I don't know anything about guns and bullets and bullet sizes and ammo and stuff like that. So, just so you know, please expect nothing from me in terms of that stuff. <laughs> please expect nothing. That said, okay, oh, you reduced the cost. 45 ACP is going to be the way to go. It's a good thing I saved a little bit of money. So, which one's better between these two, though? Which one's damage 9? Da oh, damage 10. Okay, yeah, we'll stick with the tenor then. Although, hold on, we do this, Z, grab this, okay, put it on back, and then we do this, get that in there, and bada bing, bada boom. Hello? Okay, we are silenced, good, 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 good. All right, and it's me, Mr. Moneybags, coming back for more. At least we'll see what the next level is, potentially, here. Okay, 
Wait. Disappear. One more. Okay, cool. I really need to do a bank heist. Ooh, okay. Damage 3.5, damage 6.5. It's kind of cool. They're a little more expensive, but we do have discounts right now. I do need... Yeah, okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to save my few dollars that I have left. And um, anyway, let me make some more freaking water wheels. Actually, let's do with these. Okay, more stress, more stress. We love more stress. Bada bing, bada boom. Cool. I d did I get any gearbox? I did get a gearbox. Okay. I'm just wondering, like, what my first thing should be. Uh, as far as... Holy frick, I almost dived in there again. Classic Jardonk. So, like... <laughs> Get wrecked, buddy. Love to see it. Love to see it. All right. I'm thinking, you know, let's just... We'll just hook up some water wheels here. Oh, I think you can do... Wait, easy villagers. I think the trader block does exist, yeah? Yeah, it does. Oh, it does. We can do... We just have a wall. I forgot about... <laughs> Freaking these things are gigantic. Oh, my God. Okay. <laughs> okay. Holy freak. Oh, wait. Is there the... Um, I don't see the curer thing. I don't know, man. Right. I want to make sure that, like... Wait, are we obstructing? Okay, we're not obstructing our entrance, so that's good. And then... Yeah. Okay, hopefully that'll be, like, a good start to our stress, like, pre-windmill and stuff like that. And then from there, I wonder, like, do I want to do... Do I want to do crop harvesting, or do I want to maybe do, like, a tree farm out here? Because if, if I want to generate money passively through sticks... A tree farm out here might be a good way to do it. Oh, but I, in fairness, like, I don't have the deployers that I would need in order to do that. I also need to make harvesters and stuff like that. Um, I do not want to re-rack these trees because I am trying to clear this out for a farm, probably. I think it would be kind of cool to run um, some stress in in there, though, to do a little bit of a... could be a really small harvester just on the potato farm or something like that. Could be good. Uh, but anyway, okay, just a quick reminder. I'm fairly certain that, that it is the case in this version that we are currently in. You don't have to do the maximized water flow thing in order to generate the, the stress. You can just have a have the water flowing over, and it's good. I'm fairly certain it's just I'm only saying that because I know there's going to be some folks out there who are like you're not generating the maximum stress because you're you got to have it going over all the sides and the soul sand and the and the elevator on the one side otherwise it's not it's not maximized So I'm just making sure everybody is aware of this All right all right here we go You know, it will feel a little bad, man, to do this and then um, potentially, like, not keep it or have to redo it elsewhere. Okay, if I put the water here, which way is it going to spin? How's it going to do? Okay, it does spin the correct way. Cool. That is good. We like that. That said, I want to move it over by one, probably. Or I could just, like do that. I can't remember if it has to be a source block at the top of each one. Uh, let's sleep it off. Okay. I just don't know, does it have to be a source block on top of each one, or is that not actually important? Frickin' hooked myself on the fence like an idiot. 
so good at this, guys. I'm so good at this. It's just, it's just, my, my parkour abilities are unparalleled. Move water one more block outwards. I mean, if they're spinning, it's fine. I just didn't know if, uh... I just didn't know if in order for each new one to generate stress, it had to be a source block on top. All right, all right, so far so good. Oh, wait. Uh, have I actually made... Wait, no, I haven't made new infinite sources. Those those waters are flowing into here. That's incorrect. I do need to run back. Anyway, we'll do this, and then that'll be good there. All right. Oh, wait. I think it's, it's fine. Whatever. Yeet. No, don't, no, stop. Don't do that. That's, that's incorrect of you to do. Thank you. Okay, good. So, do that. Why is it doing that? That's bizarre. Don't do that to me. Okay, we're good. Just trying to tidy up the flow here a wee bit. Perfect. Very nice. Very good. Very cool. How do we make a harvester? It is um, okay. And it's like casing. Oh, we need to. We need to do the press. Press got to be the first thing. I should. Should I run a press into the? Um, into my into my house. This is gonna be a this is gonna be an interesting thing to do here. I mean, I'm, I feel like I'm probably gonna run into my chests. How are we gonna end up into? Okay, we're ending up there. I see. Um, now if I were gonna do a press, where would I do it? Or would I do a? I'm just trying to do minimal directional changes here for the sake of, you know. Um, actually, you know what might be a good idea? Putting the uh, rotation speed controller onto here might be good, because then we can just take this, like, snail speed, and we can adjust it into everything, and also um, then adjust it down if anything is, is taking too much stress. So let's get the rotation speed controller, tack it on right there. Can zombies climb up the water? I would say, yeah, probably. <laughs> I I would think. Um, okay, got that. I'm gonna make some cogs. Excuse me, what? I'm sorry, are we doing this? Are we really gonna do that? We're really gonna do that? Okay, cool, thanks, man. Freaking guy. Freaking, imagine doing that. Imagine doing that to me. Unbelievable. Oh, I put sticks in there for some reason. Like a dummy. Um, okay, so, we gotta do, what is it? Just, it's just planks. Yeah, that's what I thought, but. All right, let's just do a few of these. And let's do a few of these. It might actually be worth trying to find gearboxes and stuff like that when we can. But anyway, oh god, I'm going to need to make some more freaking shafts as well, probably. Was that all of my... Oh, no, 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 I got more. Okay, that's good. Get a gearbox, get a couple more gearboxes, get the mechanical press. I, I feel like having the mechanical press... I mean, having the mechanical press down here would be good, but god, I, I'm gonna have to, like, bring it over here, probably. Which involves laying a lot of shaft. Dang. 
I should do andesite and iron generator with create? Oh, like, is there a machine to generate iron and andesite? Do a second basement, do a sub-basement? Oh, God, man. Oh, God. Hmm. Oh, wash gravel to get iron nugget. Got it. Um... I mean, I could just... I could do another basement, but I don't know how much I love that for us here. Um... Let me just here. I'm gonna put the I'll put the press over here just just for the time being. Again, this stuff all probably gonna have to get relocated to another place eventually, and um, so for that reason, yeah. Just listening to the rain and never stopping outside. All right, so let's do it there, there. Can I make a belt? Do I have any kelp on me? I think I had some kelp, right? Yeah. Is the recipe the standard? It is. God, only one belt though, yikes. Um, well, we might have to go get more kelp at some point. Boom. And then, um, I was thinking, you go on top of that, that'll be good. And then we gotta run this cabling out. Um, okay, so I know we can do a depot, but if I wanna if I wanna queue up a bunch, then it's gonna be better to do it this way. Um actually wait. I need to make a I could use a wrench. Except for the part where I don't have that. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna do that. And then that. I don't know if that's gonna be spinning the right way, but we'll find out. I could also use some funnels real quick. How do we make funnels again? I don't actually, it's interesting. I don't really know the crafting recipes because all this all the times that I play create, it's always in a series where the crafting recipes are like ultra complicated and modified. So I guess that's that's news. That's more simple than I thought it might be. Um Okay, I'm gonna. Oh, frick, I'm gonna have to stretch this out by one, though, aren't I? Oh dear, is it night time? I think it's night time. No, it's not night time. Just loud. But yeah, I think it'll have to be like. It's gonna be like this. Oh, balls! Not like that. I don't like that. Not one bit. Why can't I... Oh, freaking rock. There we go. Um... Whatever, I guess I can just provide the power to the other one. Yeah, we'll just see where, which way it's spinning in order to figure out where to put it. Okay, so we do that. And then we put a chest on one side, chest on the other side, couple of funnels. You know the drill. You know the drill. There we go. You know, you, you never know when you're gonna need to queue up a few all at once, right? Boom. I think it'll still press, uh, even though it's, you know, over the funnel. I'm pretty sure it still works that way, but you can't have two funnels occupying the same block, so it's gotta be like that. All right, cool. Well, let's go and uh, bring the stress in. Should we want that? We have a couple of gearboxes. That's very good, very nice. So that means, though, I should actually open this up. God, I'm going to end up having a zombie in my base back here in a moment. But I might as well just leave that open so I know where to bring the bring it in. You don't like the off-centeredness of the of the press situation? Oh no, I'm so sorry. These guys are just the kings of sneaking up on me and I hate it. Man dodged all my stuff. Get the frick back. All right, I can actually fill this back in a bit. So where was it? It was... 
Uh, I was over there. Dang. That was authoritative. God, I gotta sleep, though. I am sneaky. <laughs> World's best sleeping location. Okay, so, um, you gotta get a clear path over from here out to the thing. Oh, God. It didn't do a full breakage because I shifted. Rip. Okay, got it. Wait, that is gonna be so many freaking shafts. Hey, I don't like that. Hmm. Well, you know what? It's fine. We got a lot of we got a lot of this to go around. We'll be good. All right. I'm gonna um. How am I gonna do this? I might have to use a couple of gearboxes, which I don't like. But what can you do? All right. So that's input, and then our output is gonna be on top, and then. God, I'm gonna have to use so many gearboxes. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Use two big cogs instead of a gearbox. Eh, maybe better, but I, um, I'm gonna have to go vertical here as well, so it's gonna, gonna kind of frick me up. Hmm. Yeah, I could do belts, but actually I don't have enough kelp in order to do it. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Dang. We just drop them. We just drop them. Do the speed controller at the intersection? No, but the problem is, it's like, actually, you know what? Maybe not the worst idea in the world. But then if I do want to, uh, let's just see how it goes. Okay, so I ran the shafts over here. Speed controller does do a change of direction. It might, might save me a little bit, even though I'm going to be, like, just annoyed, probably. Um, so, do that. Put that there. Because now, here's the problem. If I, if I want to do... I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like it. Oh, God. I really should have done frickin'... Um, I really should have... I need to get a wrench. It's Okay, that's gonna be the first thing I do after this with the press once I get the stuff. Um, nah, okay. I'm just gonna do it this way, honestly. I've done... I've done much create in my lifetime. I have done much create in my lifetime. And, um, we are going to just do it. I mean, I could, I could do some funky stuff with cogs, to be fair. I could, like, you know, bring it down. And then I could do that. And then it will get very fast. To, or, no, it'll be, it'll be drop down. You just do that. to be dropped down by like one more maybe oh you know what I can do actually that's possibly even better here is just I'm I'm like looking for my wrench I'm so used to using wrenches oh no I can't actually do that just kidding that might be like that and then I'll probably just have to do like this drop it down by one and then I can do so used to having like free reign on just unlimited gearboxes that it's kind of weird not to, but whatever. Do that, and then I guess yeah, there we go. Okay, that works. Let's crank it up a little bit. Should make engineers goggles probably, but yeet. Yeah. All righty, that'll work, and we've conserved gearboxes. Very, very nice. And now we have high-speed rotation. We got high-speed rotation coming out of the source. So if we want to do a farm or something like that, we can just work off of that rather than having to speed everything up. I guess the only downside we might be facing is <laughs> if I do do a tree farm or something of the sort, there is a chance I am going to uh, do something where I get punted by saws and die. It's going to be more dangerous than the zombies will be the tree farm 
that I create. <sighs> ah, good times, man. Good times. I'm an engineer? Oh, thank you so much. Well, now the final challenge is just, um, balls. Uh, the oh, frick balls. Um, let me just let me skip back here really quick. Frick. Frick. God dang it. Zombie's gonna drop on my freaking head. Um, okay, so we're gonna just do a little bit of, uh, tell me if this is gonna work. Is it the correct direction? Tell me it's the correct direction. It is! Hooray! We are good to go. First try. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Okay, so now we can throw some gold in there. And we will have ourselves our first bit of uh, pressed stuff. I can't wait until we actually have some power as well. We can, you know, get some refined storage going in here. It will be very, very helpful. All right, so a bit of this. Um, I do... I, I probably could have done... Engineer's hammer, but I know there's gonna be other stuff. We can't do engineer's hammer like I don't think we can engineer's hammer zinc I think that has to be create so all right here. We go ten gold ingots Yeah Yeah, now we can get a wrench huge maneuvers. I know I have the thermoelectric generator I just don't know how it works. I don't know if it's part of a multi-block or something like that Our so, use a copper coil block, thermoelectric generator, water plus lava equals power. Huh. So, is it like water on one side, lava on the other, and then, and then you pop off? Really? But does it produce enough energy to be able to um, power, a, you know, a refined storage system? I guess we'll find out. Oh, it turns the lava to obby, though. Ooh. Yeah, because there's no such thing as free energy, right? So we really need an alternator, because there is such a thing as free energy in, in that case. <laughs> the water source somehow just continues to exist forever. Um, it never goes away. It's very helpful. You kind of love to see it. Um, anyway. All right. All right. There we go. You saw me on TV? Is that because you loaded up Twitch or YouTube on your TV? I can only I can only imagine that's it. All right, there we go. You saw me on shows. What shows am I on? I don't know what shows I'm on. Hmm. Oh, the gamer's guide thing. The power output is the square root of hot minus cold. 2 RF per tick where lava is 1300 and water is 300. So about 15 RF per tick. That's math. We're mathing it up there. Incredible stuff. Um, okay. Uh, well, um, I, think the, I think the alternator is going to be a better way to generate power. So we can make that. We can now do, we can now do all this stuff. The only thing that we're missing is all the mechanical crafters. So we may want to go out, hit up the residential houses, get more of the mechanic. Actually, you know what? To be fair, can I make mechanical crafters very easily at this mo moment? No. No. It's going to be way easier to yoink them from the houses. Uh, so that might be a good thing to do. And then I think yoink. I think yoink from the houses. Yeah. I think I should heal before heading out. I guess I can just med kit, right? Boom. That should do some work there real quick. Hopefully. Hopefully. So, I just, yeah, I, I, again, when I was looking around in the thumbnail world, couldn't see alternators just laying around anywhere. If it was going to be somewhere, I would think it would be in the garage that we found last time, but there wasn't one. So, all right. Bank and houses is what we've got to do here. I'm pretty sure that med kit did not actually heal any of my body parts. What good is that? So every time I come back in here, I have to use a ton of bandages due to a Minecraft limitation. That's fricked. That is ultra fricked, and I dislike it 
tremendously. Mr. Norton, you had a look at the code, and it's a mess. Oh. Good news, everyone. Good news, isn't it? All right. Well, let's get prepped here. Okay. Let's go get ourselves some... Man, you know, I, I need lapis. Lapis. That's the other thing I need, because, bro, we can get... Yeah, we can get enchantments on our stuff, which is kind of a huge thing that we need to do. Also... I could make a librarian and get, like, mending or something. I mean, holy frick. Okay, anyway, we'll worry about that later. Let me sleep for the time being, and then we will v v v room And then also, day 75 is going to approach us really quickly, isn't it? It's going to it's gonna hit us like a truck. Get wrecked, buddy. All right. Jordan should have moved to the Atacama Desert if he hates rain so much. About mending, check quests. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, you scare me. What's up with mending, huh? Hey, we got the gapple. Oh, by the way, I put some of the gapples back into... Frick, hold on. I'm an idiot. Wait a second. <laughs> I put gapples back into the chest so that I wasn't carrying all of them, and then I proceeded to uh, auto-stack the rest of them into the chest. So, oops. Let me retrieve... Some. I don't think I need that many, but um, we'll just put them in the backpack in case I, I die. Repair my weapon. Uh, let me see. I think I could do a combine on this thing. I have another one, right? I have another pokey poke. Eh, it's fine. I don't think this thing is going to break at this very moment. I think we're right. Famous last words. But honestly, we're not going to focus on any horde buildings. If I run into a horde building, then, then we go... Bye-bye, because frick that. Okie dokie. If I find a bank, I should make it my house? Bro, I don't want to live in the city. No thank you. That sounds like a terrible, scary place for me to have to deal with zombies nonstop. Better to live outside. Whew. By the way, so a little, little visualization of what I was thinking, though, is like, you know, just have, have some, like, uh, walls, like a wall here, wall here, wall, just like four walls, kind of holding up a flying saucer-esque kind of base up in the sky. Maybe you have a water elevator, or it's just a ladder protected by iron doors or something like that, button activated in order to, you know, protect, um, I should have brought blocks with me, that would have been a, that would have been a good idea, I don't know why I didn't do that. Um, uh, but anyway, yeah, something like that in order to, um, and then, and then, like, the first layer of the above-ground uh, floating base, like, it'll have, um, have vantage points so that I can shoot out at any zombies. It'll be fully surrounded by, you know, barbed wire and all that stuff for safety, and um, it'll be good stuff, hopefully. Edge Dancer, thank you for 31 months. Very much appreciated. I suppose my stream rent is due. <laughs> so you say that's a bank, the spirally glass building. I feel like we were in one of those in the first world in which we died. But anyway. Nah, bud. Oh, God. Ow, I tried rolling. I accidentally hit E instead of R, and I went into my inventory. It was not the best, um, best form that anyone's ever seen. I did a wall slide. Oh, is that what I did? Hey, what is this button there? Ooh, Duraplast. Ooh, monies. Mm, I guess we get some bandages and torches and glowstone and stuff. Is there anything? Wait, was there a chest? Oh, there's a chest right there. What do we get? Mm, sure, we can grab that stuff. Anything up here? Any? No. So this is just a food establishment, I guess. I really, really do wish that we were able to middle mouse click sort these things. Hey, purified water. That's helpful, though. Um, and then here, just chippies, oh, a little bit of this stuff, very good, very good. I, dude, I love having the backpack, it's so nice, it's so good, it's so helpful, it's kind of the best. Money, and, alright, anyway, continuing, continuing. I think that the buildings, the apartment buildings, I think those can have lapis in them, so, um, we could try diving into one of those after the bank situation. I wonder if the bank... Because I, I swear I thought we went into one, but I wonder if um it has, like, some kind of 
underground vault. Are there beds in there? Wait. Oh, hold on. It actually does. Wait a minute. Can we just... Can we just skip the formalities and... Oh, God. Frick. Oh, God. Oh, God. I wasn't ready. That's that's a bank. Guys, I, I think we found the bank. You're not wrong about that one. Okay. Dang. Money block. Money. Money, money, money. Let's go, dude. Wait, this is like enough for a gun. It's not, I don't even think, this wouldn't even be considered like robbing, right? Is there, uh, yeah, there's some spawnerinos down there. If it's the apocalypse, it's like, you know. Oh, there we go, some gold, some iron, some lapis. You know, if, if it's the apocalypse though, really, is it robbery? Slash burglary? I don't think it is. Like, no one's no one's actually using it. In fact, it's bizarre for money to even have value outside of the frickin' villagers, you know? Like, why do the villagers even care? I Do they not realize that it's the frickin' apocalypse, man? Like, what are they doing? Why care? As long as I'm not actually hurting anybody, it's kind of just... It's just pieces of paper at this point, right? Um, oh yeah, andesite cabinets. Oh, I did not realize. Thank you for the call out there. They just look like blocks of andesite. Oh man, more money blocks. Mr. Moneybags is out here, dude. Mr. Moneybags, come on. Diamonds. Oh, I need to hit up all of these that I can find. I need to hit them all up. Come on, dude. The villagers are assuming things will return to normal. Mmm, is that what it is? Hey, y'all got any uh, money blocks behind here? No, just water bottles, okay. Just, just food. Kinda anticlimactic there. But anyway, okay, wait, this is, this is good though. We, uh, now, okay, we gotta find more of these buildings, I think. I feel like I've seen them all over the place. I just didn't, I didn't realize what they were. So we gotta be, we gotta be on the lookout. Um, so we gotta, man, if I could figure out what they look like from the, from the sky. Now that would be the freaking way. So it's that one. That's gonna be, that is a very nondescript roof <laughs> to be looking for, if I'm being honest. But we need to head this way to get to the residential area anyway. Wait, top floor? Oh, you think I should hit up the top floor? Alright, fair play, fair play, we'll do that. I guess, yeah, you know, the other floors of a bank could probably have some... Yikes! I mean, that's just kind of like... Oh, yeah, there's more money blocks. Okay. I was gonna say, like, that's kind of just, you know, the same amount of money that you would find in the other apartments. Oh, it's blocks as well! Yeah, okay, this is definitely the one that I was in. I just had no idea there was a bottom floor vault thing. Oh, is that it's die packs? That's funny. I did not make that connection. <laughs> so you can get caught red-handed, thieverying the money. You know what's funny is I I do feel like. Oh yeah, so that's why there was like money and stuff here last time in the freaking CEO's desk. It all makes sense now because it was a freaking bank. Except really, it's not that much. It's kind of an underwhelming amount of money, if I'm being honest. Uh, but anyway... Okay, let's throw some of those iron blocks in there. Other stuff, probably less importante. Yeah. Okay, good. And we continue. Not today, buckaroo. Not today. Dude, this thing just actually wrecks. We, we two-shot... And same price as the other lesser ammo. Heck yeah. Yeah, no, headshots are definitely, definitely a thing. Whew. All right, let's keep it going, let's keep it going. We move, we vamoose. I'm sure we've got some more of those bank buildings. And oh god, it's a horde building, not again. 
All right, wait for it. Yo, he rolls. He rolls again. Oh, who needs MLG water bucketing when you can do it that way? Yeah, dude. There's another bank over there if we wanted to hit it up. Done. And then the, the non-special infecteds, I can, if I get a crit, I can just... You're so annoying! Why do you take so many hits, man? That was kind of crazy. RIP my ammo on that guy. Do I hit up the other bank over there? Because I see it. I see it. And I kind of want to do it. But also, it's like, is it further away from... The residential area. It is a little further away from the residential area, but it's fine. All right, let's keep it rolling. Keep it rolling. Yeah. Okay. I may have missed some shots, but whatever. Oh, I did learn though. These buildings, they have um, they have ancient debris blocks in them, which are actually used. Netherite is actually used for things. So, I do think it's worth. Yeah. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, it's a horde building. Oh, also it has a shulker. Oh no. I actually don't like this. Actually not into this. Hold on, that's freaking shulker and... Oh, quartz as well, just in case. Uh, I could get a shulker box. Just, why not? Why not? Oh god, I got a vamoose from here. I got a vamoose from here. I'm asleep. I'm asleep. I'm asleep. Okay. Everything's good. I don't think the bottom floor had ancient debris on it, but... Let me just do a quick check. I think it was just nether blocks, really. Yeah. Just a bit of quartz. Alright, anyway. Let's get rolling. I know it is. I think it's supposed to be a gym. But yeah, it kind of looks like a... A museum of the nether. Or something like that. Alright, anyway. Uppies, uppies, uppies. Over to the bank. Over to the bank. Heist it up a little bit. And then head back to residential. Yeah, we roll, bro. Um, oh no, really? It's a horde building? Okay, that's fricked up. That's fricked up. I didn't ask for this. I didn't ask for this. You know what? I wonder if I can... Because they can't get in here, right? They can't get in here. So... Oh god, okay, don't like that, don't like that. Um... I mean, this is one way to just... farm them up. And then cause the horde to stop. Grenades would be great for the basement. They would. Come on, just a few more. And then I am going to have to deal with what the frick is going on down here, but I think we can do it. Okay. Oh. That's not actually great at all. Okay. Gonna, gonna do that. Didn't realize he could um, get up there like that. Okay, we're okay. We're okay. Everything's fine. Even if we were infected, we got gappers. It's all good. They can climb. Okay. We did it, guys. Everything is good now.
everything is mostly good other than the part where they keep coming. It seems like they're spawning more now, somehow? Hmm. Whoa. Apparently got a lot of stuff from them. Wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. I swear to God, the uh, these dudes have... They've gotten more health. What the frick is happening? These guys used to be like one hit, and now all of a sudden they are just unstoppable. Holy heck. Those guys 100% have gotten gnarlier. Flippy dippy. Holy what the balls. So it would seem that they have made their way up from underground. And they're standing on each other's heads. Okay. How's the underground looking now, eh? I might need to seal up this behind me, otherwise, we could have a problem on our hands. Okay. Yeah, we're making quick work of these boys now. Perfect. Perfect. Let's go. All right. So that was a little, that one, that bank heist took a little bit more effort, potentially. Do I have any more ammo left? You know what? At least I have uh, I have money blocks that I'm going to be able to use in order to get more ammo. It's gonna be fine. Yeah, we got a huge amount of XP. Thank goodness I haven't died. Yeah, more money blocks. Huge plays. Huge plays. Did I get? I don't understand. Like, how did I get? Apparently. All of these quests for different armor sets. All right, more mo oh man, no money blocks. What are we? Oh, hey, we got a we got a nice little find there. Might actually be helpful for like hordes of zombies and stuff if we don't already have something in the necklace slot, do we? Yeah, we do. We do. I think that the actually, you know what? While we're not mining, this is a better thing to have. To be fair, uh, when we're mining, then we can put that scarf back on. Okay. Good stuff. Oh, one more. Almost missed it. All right, all right, all right. Nice. Good, good. Ah, oh, frick. I didn't mean to middle mouse click. I just messed everything up. Anyway. Cool. All right. Are we, um... Oh, Mr. Moneybags over here. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate you. Okay. Over to the residential area. Let's see if we can pick up some more uh, mechanical crafters. Also, though, wait, actually, buildings like this, I think, can contain lapis. Wait, what is, there's an underground here. What the frick is this? What is this? Oh, is this like a speakeasy little bar area? Huh. Thought this was an apartment building. Imagine having a freaking bar in the bottom of your apartment. That sounds dangerous. Ow, oh, frick you. Bar in the bottom of your apartment sounds real dangerous. Oh, some like nice veggies and stuff like that. Well, onions we could plant. A little bit of deliciousness, you know. Well, it sounds real dangerous in the in the sense that like, you know, you might. I'll get the eggs. You might feel inclined to say, partake, um, fairly often. <laughs> There's a spawner under there. Unbelievable. Right into the cauldron. Crazy. Ooh, get wrecked. Get wrecked? 
And don't you dare. Oh, that's what's up. Okay. Um. Is this not a freaking horde building? Holy frick. There's just been like way too much time left for them to spawn. Hold on. Um. It's probably a spawner. Yeah. The old bathroom spawnerino. Dead on the toilet. Dang. Sad. Oh. Man. It's not looking very lapisy in here. Maybe I should go somewhere else so that it's uh you know, we can go we can go to a place that hasn't had goddamn as many spawns. I hunger. Not infected, right? Not infected. Okay, we're good. Everything's fine. It sounds like a storm is brewing on the horizon. What the frick was that? What the frick? Yeah, that's in-game. That's- that's not- that's- That's not outside, I promise. Uh, that would be crazy. Yeah, what is going on? I'm kinda- I'm kinda nervous. What? Actually, I wonder if- can these buildings have... Uh... Oh... That's what that was. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I need to go. I need to go. I should leave. I gotta go elsewhere, like home. I'm really far away. Um, guys? It's a bad situation, I'm afraid. It's a very bad situation, I, I think. Jesus Christ. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Build up into the air and camp. Um, I... Don't have a lot of blocks on me, if you've not noticed. Oh dear. I'm out of stamina. Okay, guys, I got you. I got you. Oh dear. Oh dear. Almost out of the city. Man, all I wanted was lapis and some freaking mechanical crafters. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my. Oh frick. Oh god. Oh god, oh frick. Oh god, oh frick. The animals. The earth is upset! The earth is angry! Oh, there's the guy! Oh, they're everywhere! No, I definitely can't sleep. That's why I haven't even tried yet. I can't sleep. That's the whole thing of a blood moon. I'm in- I'm in- God, okay. Careful, careful, careful. We're getting- we're getting close to home. We're getting close to home. Oh, the runners are on me. The runners are on me. We got stamina back, though. We got our stamina back. Nothing to worry about. Nothing to worry about. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. We're in. Whoo! Can't touch this. Oh. 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 All that I wanted. All that I wanted was to get a bit of lapis, and yet here I am, yet again, unable to do any enchants. Maybe mining will be a better way to do it in the future, but frick. Let's repair that thing up. God. I think we're okay inside our home. I'm not as worried there. You know, I can get some more ammo from our boy, though. That would be good. 
That'd be good. Okay, cool. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate ya. Mr. Moneybag's up in here. And then... Very good. And also just convert all of... Oh, I wanted to have some money in my backpack just in case, but... Make more blocks. Make more blocks. Oh, let's go. All right. That is what you like to see. God. Okay. I mean, pretty sure it's just, you may not, yeah. You may not rest now. Also, it's very cold out. Huh. Holy frick, dude, that was so many zombies. Oh my god. Well, you know, what I could do in the meantime while we're blood mooning it up, I could just do a little bit of enchantment table cycling, you know? Dude? That seems like a good plan. Not enchantment table cycling, enchant cycling on a villager. Uh, let's see, shelvy poos here, a little bit of shelvy poos. There we are, a little bit of lecterny poos. Stack upgrades, maybe. I, we haven't actually filled our backpack for a while, so like it's not that critical. Um, anyway, hey man, all righty. Easy villagers, oh my god, wait a minute. Oh, guns, it's just guns that are expensive as heck. Okay, wait. Oh. 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 It's all level one. Read the quests. All right. Okay. Where is the quest? Is it under villagers? I don't know where the quest is located. It's master only mending. Ah. Uh, oh. Mending books only have a one fourth chance of being sold by master level, level librarians. Ah. I see. I understand now. I get it. Hmm. Hmm. What is Heckfire, by the way? It doesn't say. What did it create stuff? Creates given it gives an enchantment called Heckfire. Good old Prot One. I wonder how much a mending book costs. Boy, this um isn't isn't the best. What are the best enchantments at level one? I mean, silk touch, silk touch is not bad. Um, oh, I need to get the hat to cheapen things. That would be nice. Unbreaking is kind of doo-doo at level... Unbreaking at level one? Why? That sounds kind of doo-doo. Trade unbreaking books to get master. Oh, I guess that kind of makes sense. It's something that gets used a lot. Well... That's some balls. But I also need other money in order to be able to... Freaking heck. Oh. oh, okay, it goes fast. That's nice. Mending is eight money block. Oh, good. That's some great... Oh, good, and then when you... Oh, oh, yeah, level two. Level two, it goes nowhere. It goes nowhere. Ay, ay, ay. Freaking balls, dude. Yeah, unbreaking, unbreaking, unbreaking. Oh, this is so... Oh, he's out of stock. He's out of stonk, and it's nighttime. Oh, God, no. Oh, God. This is a rough time. Can you believe that it's a rainy blood moon? Like, how much... How much is it just trying to add insult to injury to me? A rainy blood moon. Can you even believe it? 
Can you even believe these guys? By the way, this looks ugly. I should take it down. Oh, jeez. Uh, Tip of 1,000, 200 bits. Heckfire is an enchant for the Create Flamethrower. Maybe a good crowd control weapon. Holy frick, what? Flame... Uh, throw... Whoa. That looks gnarly as heck. How do you make a heat engine? It's actually not that difficult looking. What's the percent? 91% chance of success. Sturdy sheets, though, are less fun to have to deal with. And, um... <laughs> burns his house... Yeah, probably would just burn everything down. It's... Not an unlikely outcome. Hey, the blood moon sets. How nice. I'm so happy it decided to do that. That's so cool of it to do. Alright, still sorting. Uh, I've just heard an unpleasant noise outside. What was that noise? Is that a freaking cow? Is that the noise that I heard was a cow or a goat? Good lord, I'm pretty sure it was. It's just a cow or goat, dude. It sounded like an absolute unit. But no, just you guys. I can't hit you. Oh god, did I get... Oh, I got nausea. Not infected, at least. Goodbye. So... Frick this. I do not wish to go out during the rain. This is terrible. It's gonna be zombies spawning non-stop no matter what. Yeah, hey, look at this. Nah. This is doo-doo. You know what? This is probably a good time for us to wind down this episode. Hey, wait, he has restonked though. I could I could do a few more unbreaky books. Just to have. But uh make sure to like the video. Subscribe to Captain Sparkles 2. Follow at twitch.tv slash Captain Sparkles to tune into these live. What are we gonna get on the next level? What are we getting on the next level, eh? Loyalty 3, Backstabbing 3. Not gonna lie, these are underwhelming enchants that we're getting here. Hopefully we get mending, but only a 25% chance is kind of rough. A lot of unbreaking that we can combine, though. Make a tunnel to the city. I believe that's what the subway is for. <laughs> um, which, I mean, we could dig a tunnel to from here to the subway and then like use that to get into the city but regardless anyway getting distracted uh subscribe to the channel help us get to one mil um follow at twitch.tv slash captain sparkles check out apex hosting code captain sparkles 25 percent off your first month you can play this mod pack with your friends and um next time around hopefully we can get ourselves lapis and uh an alternator that would be pretty huge all right see you next time